what you're not to demean you. I'm telling you what you're not so that you know what you should be. 2010 Green Party candidate for United States Senator from Illinois and author of Our America, Life and Death on the South Side of Chicago, Lee Allen Jones visited Columbia on Tuesday, October 21st to speak with a couple of first year seminar classes. Though the presentation was intended to focus on Jones's book, he instead abandoned that agenda to cover a whole other set of topics. Economics, systems, oh, systems. and emotions, all right? Economic, how does that occur? You know why that occurs? Because people get emotional, right? And guess what happens in rooms when people get, you know, like let's look at the Harold Washington there. Y'all know who Harold Washington was? Not just a man. <laughs> he just was just not a man. Harold Watson was the first black mayor in Chicago. So Harold represented something on a larger dynamic. Guess what Harold Washington represented? In such a way, well, what else could Harold represent if it wasn't just race? What did he represent if it wasn't race? Information. Harold was a state representative, he was a congressman, and he had the most legislative experience of anybody when he was running. So guess what that man Harold had? He had, he had what? Information that became power. I think the seed that I'm planting here and the opportunity that I've had to present here is to be able to expand people's understanding. Expand smart people's understanding, because smart people are smart, but they don't, a lot of times they don't evolve their understanding. And my thing is to say that, you know, as a generation of young people that have all of this access to information, how is it that you don't have, you don't have, you don't, you don't have more of it and don't even understand what you do have relative to information? And so for me, I've been a college student and I've been in the real world. You know, how is it that you can be in a place like this and ask very basic fundamental questions about social uh, information, uh, global information, and historical information, and people not have an understanding of any of those things and how it relates to their present life and how it's going to project and influence their life in the future. And, you know, and for many students anywhere is the fact that you have a generation of people that are, that it's not going to be about black or white or really rich or poor in this generation is going to be in how do you manage and utilize information. And you have a generation that has access to disseminate information ubiquitously. If we have invested all of this money as a society in your education through taxpayer dollars to fund public education, and the, and the only thing that you can respond to with that is to show how, you know, the, the word of the year is ratchet you are, then where's the resilience at? And what is that ratchetness, how does that ratchetness undermine the resilience a generation is going to have to have to have social and economic sustainability?